Knock, knock. I'm Mr. Kate. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. Oh, hi. I'll drop by for a while. Mr. Kate. I'll help you find your style. Mr. Kate. We'll laugh. We'll paint. I'm Mr. Kate. Yay! Ugh, gray, blah, blah. <laughs> Ew. Plain, plain, plain. Hi guys! Welcome to my bedroom to talk about socks because if you're like me, sometimes you find that your sock drawer is rather uninspiring. And this summer, I want to spruce up things in my wardrobe that I already have. And today, I'm going to add some bling to my socks because bling makes everything better. So with these having some bling, I'm then going to wear them this summer probably with some socks and sandals, which I actually love to do because I think it looks really cute and fresh and funky. And it keeps my toesies from getting sweaty. All you need is a pair of socks, some sew-on rhinestones in various shapes, and sizes, some thread, and a needle. So this is very up to interpretation, as are most of the DIYs I do. I'm gonna just arrange my rhinestones in rather sporadic order, but you could do it in a very regimented way or create a little design like a flower or something. These are sew-on rhinestones, which basically means they're in a setting, and the setting has four holes. And I'm just gonna use a thread in a similar color to my sock, and I'm gonna double up the thread so that it's nice and strong. And it's basically like sewing on a button. You guys know how to sew on a button? You should! <laughs> I mean, do whatever. You don't know how to sew on a button. No judgment. No judgment here! So I'm just sewing on these beautiful rhinestones with my thread, and then I'm just looping through and I'm just crisscrossing along the back so that I can make sure to thread the needle and thread through all of the holes. All right, so I'm done with this pear-shaped one. Now I'm gonna move on to a round one, because again, I'm doing a sporadic thing, but if you wanted to not be so sporadic, because you're not as bad like me, then you can do whatever you want. I'm just gonna continue all the way around and then of course repeat on the other sock because I have two feet. And this is so gonna make a difference in my life. <laughs> now I can take my jazzy DIY socks out on the street. They're not plain anymore because why not? Thank you.